Hello folks, back again. Smelt fishing under the ice 2016. What's the date today? The 20th? 20th of December. And me and Jordan come out and set a net here yesterday evening. There, there's the old golf course war from the truck. Nelson sitting in the truck. Anyway, we come out. I didn't know what the ice would be like, but put a foot thick as you can tell from them blocks of ice when we uh, run the net under. Anyway, it was cold, pretty cold here, so. Anyway, we're gonna see what's in today, Jordan. Yeah, hopefully it's cold. Okay, just take your time. I see one, two, two. Oh, yeah. Yeah, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, oh yeah. Yeah, not a big run though, but just the nice ones we like to eat. Yeah. Not a bad pick. Sometimes we leave them for two days and then you get double the amount. These are going fresh this way. Yeah, they stay pretty fresh the other way too. Yeah, there's a nice pick. Enough for uh, some good, there's some lively ones in there. Oh yeah. You just fished this morning. Yeah, they're perfect size melts. There's the end. Anyway, we done okay there. Definitely a couple good feeds. You said the big tides are on, so once the tide's slack in here, we'll we'll do a little bit better at them. But anyway, we go reset the net, and we got a rope right here. We one person goes down and pulls the rope. Oh yeah, nice little smell. They're nice when they're on the ice, frozen like that, let them freeze. I'm surprised there's no big large ones though. They, you get the big large ones with just their teeth stuck in the net. There's a few of them hop around, there's some lively here. Right? Oh yeah. Anyway, I just thought to make this video. We'll keep making a few videos here. This is usually a good spot. One year we got like 180 smelts out of one net, one night. So here in the next few days the tide starts. We're just coming off the full moon, so. Anyway, okay, we're gonna end off with that. We gotta get picking. Cheers.